Hi. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to use the round function. The round function allows you to round a number to a number of decimal places that you specify. So that could be zero if you wanted to make it a whole number, or three decimal places, depending on what your needs are. So I've got in cell I5 uh, a, a random number that I've generated, and I'm going to uh, raise the round function to round that number to the nearest whole number. So I'm going to use the round function, so it's equals round. I'm going to open a bracket. I'm going to select the number. Okay, so the number is the number that I want them to, to round, comma, and then it's asking me for the number of digits. So that's the number of decimal places that you want. So I want zero. And then I'm going to close the bracket and press enter. And you can see that that's rounded the number down to the nearest whole number. If that number was 15.6, let's change that to 15.6, that would now round up to 16 because that's rounding up to the nearest whole number. So we're going to use the same principle to round the average age to a whole number. So I'm going to, this is going to be my number. So the number that's generated by the average is this 13.87 here. So I'm just going to build my round function around that average. So I'm just going to click in for, after the equals, I'm going to type in round and then open a bracket. So it's using the same structure as a, a, a function as the one I did over here. So now there's my number, okay, because that's the number that's being calculated, comma, and the number of digits I want to change to zero, and then close the bracket. So that's exactly the same structure of formula. So equals round, this section here is the number, oops, sorry, this section here is the number, to that bracket there okay and that is the number of digits so when I press enter that number is now rounded to 14 if you wanted to, if you needed to uh, to change to a different number of decimal places then if I change that to a 1 for example that would change my um, number of decimal places to 1 okay so you can see how that works but we want it set to 0 so that's how you use the round function to round to a specified number of decimal places.